Hi all, we're here to talk to you about our latest release of our applications products version 12. My name is Bruce, I have with me Kelly and Sylvia from our products team here at HP. And as you can see, I'm actually in a hotel in Amsterdam and uh, Sylvia is, is with us over there, I think in Boston, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, hi Bruce, how are you? Good. Kelly, I think you're, uh, you're holding things down in the fort back home. I am. Uh, <laughs> We're all on the road talking to our customers about this, this wonderful new release, and, and it's so exciting. I think uh, what this release is all about is how velocity and quality really can live together in a perfect world. In fact, Kelly, are you a triathlete? I am, yes. <laughs> yeah, and let me share a picture here that I have for you, Kelly. Yeah, tell about this picture, Kelly. Uh -huh. You're like in a bike going fast, and uh, what that has to do with our kind of a release that we have like an unprecedented um, velocity versus quality. How that means, what that means for you at being an athlete. Oh, absolutely. It's such a great metaphor. So this picture is actually from a triathlon that I did in Australia. It was actually an age group world championship. And I'm comfortably pedaling along, but I got to see firsthand what happens when velocity is um, taken over and above everything else, including quality. And there was a large group of athletes ahead of me that were biking really, really fast, but they weren't necessarily paying attention to what I would like to call defects in the road, like bumps and potholes. And so, unfortunately, I had to do some quick maneuvering in this particular race because they crashed. And, you know, we see that with our customers, too, in that there's such pressure right now to release faster and faster that it sometimes comes at the expense of quality. And so we need to be engineering in and planning for uh, continuous quality as we're trying to release faster because uh, we want to get new capability out to our customers quickly, but we want it to be an engaging experience. We want it to be able to perform and, and basically give customers what they're looking for um, rather than a defect and have to redo. So this release, Apps 12, much like an effective uh, cycling um, experience in a triathlon, is all about balancing quality and velocity. So let me talk a little bit about uh, the key aspects of Apps 12 uh, that we're going to share with you today, and then I'm going to turn it back over to you, Sylvia, to really uh, dive into one of the key ones. So there's five big enhancements in this release that really uh, dovetail with velocity and quality. The first is the ability to leverage the cloud to do really effective and large-scale performance testing. The second is to provide our customers a remarkable user experience so they're more effective at getting their teams to work together and creating that traceability between the business requirements all the way through development and testing activities. The third is really preparing for the challenges of mobile and agile testing. So we have a number of new capabilities for mobile quality and also for quality in continuous integration and agile development organizations. And finally, just wrapping it all with a very flexible experience in terms of how you can get access to the capabilities and how you can actually deploy them or leverage software as a service. So those are really the five main aspects of the launch. And I think what I want to do, Sylvia, is turn it over to you to talk more about cloud testing because this is such an exciting new capability. So take it away. Yeah, it is, Kelly. And then, as you mentioned, in your triathlon, right, you'd have to be fast and you need to perform well, right? The same thing with applications. And it's very exciting, this release 12, that you are bringing in HP Performance Center and HP Lower the cloud capabilities. It's a feature that I'm sure all of you guys were waiting for. And this cloud capability now allows you to manage the cloud management, the cloud load generators throughout the global. So with this new feature, we allow customers to basically create their own accounts from the software and then manage the accounts also, expand the provision load generators all around the globe, as I mentioned, and especially like in Brazil. I'm from Brazil, so we're going to have World Cup very soon. We need performance there. <laughs> so we can measure from anywhere in the world the capabilities of performance. And then you are able to also execute the tests from anywhere and then manage the accounts afterwards. So this brings a lot of cost savings and also resource savings because uh, you can do the administration from one place, one single place, HP Performance Center or HP Low Runner. Great capabilities, and I would love to show more details for you guys. So another point that we want to bring to is the mobile capabilities. 
And I would like to turn back to Kelly. Kelly, would like to talk about mobile capabilities and don't forget the performance and functional within uh, mobile. Absolutely. Thanks, Sylvia. The cloud testing is really exciting. Um, just that ability to rapidly scale up and leverage the cloud for global testing is so powerful. Um, another key aspect of Apps 12, however, and another really critical agenda for all the customers we're talking to, is how can we effectively test and create an amazing experience for um, users that are engaging with applications from their mobile devices. And so we have a number of new enhancements coming with Apps 12 to really simplify the process of mobile testing and also to provide um, a lot of uh, options in terms of how you set up your, your testing environments for mobility. So we've enhanced both our functional and our performance testing solutions for mobile. On the functional side, we've added new features for when you're manually stepping through a mobile application to make it really easy to capture what's happened in a series of steps and then package that up. Uh, wrapped with information like uh, recording in a, in a movie form, uh, screen annotations, and then be able to deliver that to the developers so they instantly know where issues might be. So much more effective mobile testing um, from a manual functional perspective. And on the performance side, we've added a, a bunch of new features to make it easier to create performance tests that run on your mobile devices and to account for the network variance. Because one of the big things about performance in mobile is that network. And you know people are going to be accessing it on networks all over the globe, 2G, 3G, LTE, all kinds of networks. And we want to make sure that as you're performance testing, you're accounting for that network latency, that network jitter, things that might give you uh, or might provide um, a different experience depending on where people are coming from or impact how much capacity you can handle. So a number of key enhancements for mobility and I definitely encourage you all to take a look at them. Um, we've got a lot of additional information out on the web on hp.com on our mobile testing enhancements and again it's really to give our customers the ability to roll out those mobile apps that are going to be five star experiences. We're all looking for those five stars. Yeah, so Kelly, I have just a quick question. When sure. you're riding your bike, do you also use your cell phone with you? Uh, no, 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 that's too much. <laughs> I'm not that coordinated. Okay, <laughs> good. That's a great idea. stay focused. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, you know, and, and speaking of five-star experiences, uh, I want to actually give Bruce a chance to talk about the new user experience with our Apps 12 portfolio as well, um, because we've really taken that approach to giving our users a remarkable new um, way of interacting with our products. So, uh, Bruce, why don't you talk a little bit about the new user experience enhancements with Apps 12? Sure. So, uh, before I do that, I mean, I've been on the road, as I mentioned, for a while. I was in London. I was in Amsterdam. I've, I've met with uh, customers several different places. And I'll tell you, mobile, of course, is hot everywhere, right? Everybody is very interested in building mobile apps and in what we have to help them build those mobile apps quicker, faster, cheaper, and, and of course, with much higher quality. Uh, performance testing, Sylvia, the, the load runner in the cloud, performance center in the cloud, you know, people get so excited about the ability to scale up very quickly with uh, smaller projects potentially, uh, but be able to run even thousands or millions of users. Uh, it, it's, it's just terrific for that. So they're all really excited. I've had a great experience hearing from our customers. To Kelly's point, uh, we also made some enhancements to our ALM product. And by the way, when we say apps version 12, we're talking about a, a lot of our products that we've enhanced. We've enhanced uh, application lifecycle management, quality center, uh, load runner and performance center, UFT or uh, uh, Unified Functional Testing, our Service Virtualization 3.5 actually instead of version 12, uh, and as well as our, our UFT mobile product. So there's, there's quite a few uh, new enhancements that we've made when we say Apps 12, that's what we're talking about. So looking at the, uh, the user interface, the user interface has been another one of those things that has been very exciting for these customers we've been meeting with. They're, they're getting really excited. We've built on ALM and Quality Center, a, a new web-based interface, uh, fully cross-platform, cross-browser compatible uh, for requirements and defect management. And they're really excited about the opportunity to be able to get more and more of their end users into the lifecycle management processes that they're already in. Uh, the business analysts, for example, of course, developers who, who need to check in defects and see what defects are there. Uh, in fact, I, I think I have a... Uh, I have a screen shot here somewhere. Let's see if I can show that. Um, of the new requirements management capability, this is actually 
the live, I should say live, it's a screenshot of a live a version of, of application lifecycle management. And what you see there is traceability. And uh, it's, it's exciting that we can share this with our customers. And, and you mentioned it's two modules right now, requirements and defects management, be able to get a whole bunch of new people involved in lifecycle processes. So this is, from my experience, we've had a, a great time meeting with customers, telling you about these new features. Uh, we're hopeful that you, uh, who are looking at this and, and hearing, hearing us talk today, will go learn more about our application's version 12 release. Go to our blogs, go to our websites, and you'll be able to find out uh, anything you want to see, anything you want to hear about the product. Anyway, have a great day. There's, Thanks, there's Sylvia. Thanks, Kelly. I, actually, there is more. There is the community edition license that we need to ah. mention about, right? Ah, yes, yes. That's very yes. new. Don't forget that. <laughs> we also <laughs> save the best for the last minute, right? So yeah. just about performance center and low runner, you now are uh, able to download this license and use for unlimited time. So 50 users, 50 users to be used for unlimited time. So that's the community edition that we have. How about ALM, um, Bruce and uh, Kelly, about UFT and service virtualization? What do we have? Yeah, you know, there, there's a lot of new capabilities across the board, and um, service virtualization has now integration with network virtualization, so you're able to really account for that network latency when you're doing your testing. And we've also refreshed the user experience uh, for UFT to make that unified functional testing a lot easier as well. So all of this, there's a lot of information about this launch. As Bruce mentioned, I want to go ahead and emphasize our blogs. Um, you can get the double click across all these new capabilities, and those are off of our website. So if you go to hp.com slash go slash ALM or slash software, you'll see the link to go to our blogs, uh, ALM blog, Future of Testing, uh, Performance and Load Runner, and you can get the really rich detail on all these new enhancements we talked about. So I really want to encourage you to go there and um, learn more. Uh, all that information is available for you. There's videos. There's a lot of great stuff. So more than we can really encompass in a, in a short um, Google Hangout, but I want to encourage you to check it out. Uh, that's Sylvia. great. Thanks, Sylvia. I'll see you guys very soon. All <laughs> right. See you later. Bye, everyone.